What's up, what's up, what's up? Welcome to Cooking with E and T. Cooking with T and E. Today you are cooking with E. And we're going to continue on with our game day snacks. Today we're doing buffalo wings. And I'm going to give you my take on my buffalo wings, y'all. So let's start off with what I season my meat with. Okay, right now, we put in Creole seasoning, Larry seasoning salt, we got garlic powder, onion powder, sea salt, paprika, and inside of our flour, I put crushed red peppers, cayenne pepper, and Italian seasoning along with onion powder and garlic powder as well. All right, we are waiting on the oil to get hot. Waiting on the oil to get hot. But I'm going to go ahead and put this in the flour, put my wings in the flour. And I'm not, I didn't cut my wings up because I actually like the whole wings better than I like the single wings, however you want to say it. But I like the whole wings, actually, being all honest with you. And that's what we're going to have. Well, that's what I'm going to have, but I'm going to fix everybody else's leg quarters. So we're going to shake that up, and we're waiting on that to get hot. And while we're waiting on it to get hot, this is what we're going to do. We're going to get started on the wing sauce. So let me get some butter, because we're going to need some butter. Okay, good. Here goes a stick of butter right here on the door. I don't have to hunt for none. That's the best part. Let me see. Oh yeah, it's getting hot. That's getting hot. Okay, I'm gonna turn this eye on and go ahead and put the butter in here and we can start frying this chicken. Y'all gonna get this chicken fried on. <laughs> Ooh, everywhere. And I'm gonna bring y'all over here so y'all can see what I'm doing in a minute, but let me get it on first. Okay, yeah, we ready. We ready. She ready. And you can put whatever you want your seasonings on that you want to have on there. You can put whatever seasoning you like. These are the seasons I like to season my chicken up with. And y'all, I'm fresh getting our work coming straight in to cook. And I'm tired. I haven't had a break yet. Okay, I'm going to turn this down because it is on high. So I'm going to put that on six for all us electric stove people. Only for the electric stove people. That's number six. So, how was y'all day today? My day was a very, very busy, busy day. Very busy. I am going all out my way for y'all. I'm trying to get y'all to hook up on these here game day snacks. Because this is something you could just invite your friends over and have a good time yelling at the game and everything. Because, you know, I'm down with my Auburn, baby. I'm down with my Auburn. I'm going to get y'all over here in a minute because I'm definitely going to let y'all see how I make my sauce. Move this stuff over here. I'm going to turn that heat down to medium. Over here. 
Okay. I made enough room for y'all. Y'all can come on over here and see what I'm doing. So right now I'm melting the butter. I'm melting the butter. And what's going to go inside with this here once it melts is we're going to put some hot sauce. And like I said, I'm using my bull hot sauce. But you can use whichever you want. You can use whichever you want. I'm going to go ahead and pour the hot sauce in here. Turn that back up to about six as well. And if this is not enough hot sauce, because we're not going to eat butter, we're definitely not going to eat butter, I can add some more. Okay, I think I'm going to add a little more hot sauce in here. I'll open up another bottle. Do a little bit of a half. Half of one. Let me move my chicken around a little bit. Oh, it looks so good already. I cannot wait to eat one for y'all, honey, with this sauce. Okay. We're going to let this come up to a little bit of a boil. Don't that look good? And while that's doing that, I've already cleaned my lemon. I'm going to add some lemon zest in here. And I love lemon. Oh my gosh, I love it. And this is a very, very good sauce. I promise y'all. Follow this recipe. You're going to love, love, love. Love it. My boy Courtney. This your sauce, boy. You love this sauce right here. I should have invited you over, but I'll try to talk to you before you left out the job. To tell you I was doing wings and come get you some. Because I know you love my wings and my wing sauce. Alright. That's enough. I zest the whole lemon basically. Because I just like that twain up in there. So I'm going to cut the lemon because we're going to use the lemon juice too. A whole lemon. But you want to cut a little bit of that heat there. And my hands are clean. Okay. I'm going to taste it at this point because I want to at least see do I need to add another lemon in here. No, it don't need no more lemon. That's perfect. Now, we're going to add a little mustard. A little bit of mustard. Find it to your liking. Okay. 
Mm-hmm. Look at that right there. A little bit of mustard. Let me see if I need to add a little more mustard. This is a new spoon. Okay. Now, this is what's going to really make this sauce what you want it to be. Is we're going to add a little bit of cornstarch in here to give it a thickening agent so that it will thicken up the sauce. It won't be a runny sauce. So I say about a spoon. just want to thicken the sauce up so it'll lay good on the um, chicken uh oh a little splatter let me get my my um whisk I want my other whisk That's okay. See, that sauce is thickened. And that's what you want. It's to thicken that sauce up a little bit, not like it's just hot sauce coming out of bottom. We're going to turn this down because it's basically done as soon as I get these little lumps out of him. Should have had my whisk in the first place. This is gonna be good, honey. I'm here to tell you. Find my chicken over. And we ain't rushing the fried either, honey. Let it cook. Cause this fresh grease too, so I need to sit there. It's not watery. And that's not what I wanted. I didn't want the water concept. I wanted the sauce concept. And you can fix your wing sauce the way you like it. If you like it the other way without the um cornstarch in there you are um, welcome to do it that way you don't have to add cornstarch but I want the thickness of it to lay on the um on the wings that's one little piece I couldn't get to do right but I can't wait to dip my wings in this sauce So why that is going on, all right, now I got a question for y'all, did y'all see power last night, oh my god, oh my lord, that little boy scared me honey, cause uh, he was going against the grain honey, how you gonna go against your mama, baby they scared me, that was a good one there baby, old 50 cent Curtis dead honey. Uh-huh. I see stars must have paid you off to get off the show.
Must have paid you off to get off that show, baby. Well, honey, you make your coins. Make your coins, Curtis. If you don't do nothing else, you made your coins last night. That one you did. <laughs> you made it, baby. Because that show was off the chain last night. I can't even lie. I plan on looking at that two or three more times. Because I, I want to see what I missed. I want to see it again. Then I want to see it one more time to make sure I don't miss nothing. Okay? I'm trying to told you. You did that. That show right there was done well. I ain't gonna lie, that little boy did scare me, honey. He made me think he was gonna go against that mom. Where we do that at? I'm gonna carry you for nine months and my body stretch my body out. You go against me, baby. You got to be crazy. Okay, I'm putting my other chicken in there, which I'm not gonna leave y'all in here to watch me cook all this chicken. But I just wanted to basically let y'all see the wing sauce and what I was doing for dinner tonight. Because we're going to have chicken and fries. Chicken and fries. Yes, we are. I went on my cousin them house yesterday for Sunday dinner, so I didn't cook Sunday dinner. I had a blessing. And I didn't have to cook, but I had to make some dip, of course. Because y'all see that today. I put that out there today. It's a um, sardine dip for all my sardine lovers, people that love sardines, please go out there and check that video out with the sardines and with the um, corned beef. The one I did with the corned beef, check that out too. That's a good dip um, for parties. You know, people want you to do stuff at work. You could take it to work. You could tell I'm still at work. I'm, I'm going to leave it on until I get through, child. Okay, somebody call him. I could just answer it right here. Okay, let's go look at this chicken. Okay, that's almost done. I'm going to get ready to put it inside this sauce. And once I put it inside the sauce, I'm not going to try to make this video long at, for y'all at all. Because I want y'all to watch it. I want y'all to be able to watch it, okay? That's what I'm talking about. And I appreciate everybody that come out here and look at us. I want y'all to like, subscribe, leave comments down below, and share this. Share the video. Please share the video. Share it. If you like it, especially this wing sauce, if you like the wing sauce, tell me. If you tried it, tell me if you did something different that I could try on mine, on another, on another one, you know, when I do it again. Just tell me. You might have a better way of the way to do it than I do. So please share that. Yes. I'm going to take this out and put it on a napkin. Because I definitely don't want um, any oil mixed up in my sauce. So I'm going to definitely put it on a napkin first and get the oil off of it and then dip it. And I'm going to show y'all me doing that. But I made this video basically to show y'all how to make your own wing sauce. And I like the whole wings because I like the tip. I love the tip. I'm going to let that sit there for a second. And go ahead and put my um my other chicken in before I sign out with y'all. Then I'm going to knock out my french fries. And then I'll be done. I get the rest at that point. Ooh. I ain't going to tell y'all what happened. I am not going to tell y'all what happened. I'm not. <laughs> I didn't put the top all the way down good. I'm just 
just put my chicken in. Okay, turn that heat down a little bit. I'm going to have to put my blower on, so I'm definitely going to have to get out here with y'all because I don't want no smoky house. So, okay, let's get back down to the wing sauce. Let's get back down. Okay. And then we're just going to basically put our wings up in him, baby. There we go. Oh, there it go. Oh, that looks so good. You can't tell me that don't look good. You just can't tell me that don't look good. Mm, mm, mm. And I have it on like three right now. But that looks so good. Okay. I'm going to plate this right quick. Then. Let's go back over here. And let me try this for y'all. It's hot. It's good and hot. Mm. It's hot. It's hot. Mmm. Y'all know. And y'all gonna follow now another recipe. Do this wing. Do this wing time. Cause they're playing play on too. Bye bye. Chicken good too. Don't get it wrong. <laughs> mm. Mm. But this man's house. Mm. Mm -hmm. gonna leave this tip out. I love home huh? more than anything. Mm. Mm. That's why I leave it together. Because I want the tip. Well, thank you again for watching Cooking with ENT. Cooking with tea and me. My nose already running. This sauce is giving me life. I'll see y'all. Like, subscribe, comment down below, and share this video with people that love to cook. I'll see y'all later. Peace.